breaking news now live at five. A major electric car manufacturer now halting construction of its five billion dollar Georgia facility. Atlanta News First Patrick Quinn is live at five and Patrick Rivian just made that announcement today. And Blair, we're digging into the implications of this unexpected announcement. Rivian, yes, they are putting a halt on that factory roughly an hour east of Atlanta. However, they stressed they are still coming to Georgia. And we were able to talk with a spokesperson for a state agency. They believe that Rivian remains committed to the state. They said just six days ago, Rivian actually made a payment on their 2,000 acre property in Morgan and Walton counties. But this certainly will delay the move here and the launch of this continued brand of this EV company. Now, Rivian said this move to produce their R2 model out of Illinois and not Georgia will save them $2.25 billion. A spokesperson from the Georgia Department of Economic Development told us today that Rivian remains committed to meet 80% of its $5 billion investment and bringing 7,500 jobs to Georgia by 2030. Following this news, I jumped on a Zoom call with Georgia's Labor Commissioner, Bruce Thompson. He said Rivian and the EV industry is a risk, but he believes it will pay off for Georgia. Georgia. That project may not be a future Rivian project, but it certainly could be something else. Maybe it's General Motors, maybe it's Apple, maybe it's something completely different, but we don't like to see what happened. But at the same time, I don't think it was an investment or getting in bed with the wrong individuals. So there may be a delay on some of those Rivian, Rivian jobs coming online here in Georgia. However, Commissioner Thompson, he was glowing today after the recent job report here in Georgia, where the unemployment rate here in Georgia, it dropped for the first time in more than a year down to 3.1 percent. That's way lower than the national average. We're live in Midtown tonight. Patrick Quinn, Atlanta News First. At five, Fulton County.